Welcome to Youth Music, home to discovering new up-and-coming bands from numerous different genres every single week. We have made it all the way to episode 25 of our series, Bands You Need to Know, with episode 26 in the works as we speak. You guys know what to do. Check out the clips, follow the links, give them a follow, and check out all their tunes. But before we begin, be sure to give us a follow on all our social medias to stay up to date with your favorite and new up-and-coming band. We're kicking off this episode with a band we've had our eyes, ears, and hearts set on since their debut about a year ago with their single, Patience. The anticipation has been killing us, but as of today, all the waiting has come to an end. They just released their debut EP, Vacant, which features four hard-hitting tracks, each one putting a chokehold on our feels that just keeps getting tighter and tighter as it rolls on. Blending pop-punk, emo, and even some tendencies of post-hardcore, they bring something unique to the table with tracks like Desperate, October, and Pumpkin Eater, all along with a brand new re-recorded version of Patience, which was reworked by Andrew Wade, who works with a day to remember a neck deep, among many others. If you're looking for something to stick with you for quite some time, or maybe even something that could be a downright favorite in time, this is it. Be sure to pick up Vacant, available everywhere now. This is Magnolia Park. I think I've had enough You're thinking about you P's pop punk band from the San Francisco Bay Area formed in 2015 but under a different name. After entering Lumberyard Studios in 2018 with Nick for Man Overboard and Ace of the Early November, they decided to change their name along with the release of their debut EP, Until Morning Comes. Hitting those early emo 2000s vibes along with some modern energy and direction, this band hits all the right spots with singles Positivity and Friday Nights Don't Last Forever. The band is currently working on their sophomore EP with Sam Pure at Panda Studios, which is anticipated to release in the fall. They will also be on a Southwest tour in August and are set to return to the Lumberyard with Nick and Ace during the fall to record their third release. If you're a fan of All Time Low, New Found Glory, and State Champs, then you're gonna love this. They are Goldview. Defeated with no sex of pride. take no foreign answer. They're just spreading the cancer of all these worthless lies. Don't listen to the voices in your head That tell you you can't do this but you can You're stronger than you'd ever think you'd be It's just a simple matter of positivity Starting in the summer of 2015 as a solo project, this emo slash pop punk band from Boston quickly grew some legs and started dishing out some energy packed bangers with two EPs and a handful of singles under their belt so far. But so far only lasts so long because they just released their brand new EP while you roam today. So definitely check that out and add it to all your playlists. Perfect for these hot summer days, they put forth an effort reminiscent of emo pop punk classics like All Time Low, The Wonder Years, The Story So Far, and Made a Parade, with upbeat, energetic, and fun tunes with meaningful and at times almost heartbreaking lyrics. If you like what you hear, be sure to peep the full EP. This is Sounds and Scenarios. Can't you see?
Everything from fun and somberish tunes right into some decadent chaos. This five-piece progressive metalcore band from Fayetteville, Arkansas got their start earlier this year and recently released their debut single, Nexus. Displaying a scream-sing dynamic over top crushing but yet elegant instrumentals, they craft a sound that can be loved by numerous music crowds. They are only getting started, so give them a follow now to stay up to date on future material. If you're a fan of ERA, North Lane, Architects, and Invent Animate, then you're gonna love these guys. They are Leona. Deathcore's Best Kept Secrets. This melodic deathcore band based out of San Antonio and Austin, Texas released their debut album Lucid Connection last year and has since gained a massive following along with signing with Heretic Records. They followed it up with the single Peace and Suffering which is off their second album that is in the works right now. They will also be re-releasing their debut album with four new tracks and some guest vocals supplied by Kyle Medina of Body Snatcher, Nick Young of Pillars of Autumn, and Hunter Durr of Sleep Sculptor on songs that were on the original release. There is not a single thing about this band not to love. The vicious shrieking and guttural vocals, the intense guitars, and thunderous drums, you direly need to hear this if you haven't yet. They are Desolate Blight. <laughs> Forming last year, this six-piece from Arkansas blend elements of metalcore, deathcore, thrash, groove, and much more to create an all-out explosion for your ears. Starting out with their debut song, Phantom, last November, they let it be known that they are a force to be reckoned with. Groovy, bendy chords accompany the diverse scream vocals, which is all served with a sense of dread you can't help but love. The band is hard at work on new tunes, so give them a follow and keep your ear out. This is The Delirium Effect. What up, This five-piece metalcore band from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada take influences from the Ghost Inside, Veil of Maya, and many other top metalcore acts and throw in some old-school hardcore elements to create an energy fuel banger that is their debut self-titled EP, which is available everywhere now. Heavy riffs and breakdowns that never seem to end, insane scream vocals that are occasionally accompanied by a massive hook, this thing will have you coming back for numerous listens. If you dig what you hear, be sure to follow the links and jam their full EP. This is... Plane shifter.
Wild and Eccentric, this five-piece experimental progressive post hardcore band from Texas debuted with their self-titled EP on May 10th, and it's definitely something to fall in love with. Insane riffs and raw, quirky vocals, they blend sounds similar to Secret Band, The Dillinger Escape Plan, The Mars Volta, and many more, and the outcome is simply glorious. Check out the full EP in the links provided. This is Orange Sunshine. Oh. 